the latest better hash update. Is it worth your time? Let's find out. Shane here, Crypto Fish YouTube channel. Thank you for clicking on and watching this video. I appreciate it. So today we're going to look into the latest version of Better Hash. We're going to see a live Coinbase withdrawal, so people are interested in that. And also I'm going to pick a winner for this week's Bitcoin Fridays. So stay tuned for that. A little bit about myself. I've been in the cryptocurrency space for nearly two years. Do a lot of speculative coin mining, comparison on different miners and GPUs. And of course, I give away Bitcoin on every Friday. So be sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell, and hammer those likes. I would appreciate it. All right, so let's get into Better Hash. I'm sure most of you guys know what Better Hash is. Profit switching miner. Newest version, you just click download, and it's 3.118.0.23. You'll have to type yes in here, click download. Now I have this running on my NVIDIA rig right now, right here. So the latest version, it seems to be about the same as the previous ones. It looks like they just did some uh, bug fixes and stuff. You go over to their Facebook page, latest post. Today we worked on a notification system. The improvements will make it more reliable. And make sure you get a warning message as soon as the miners stop working. We'll keep you updated. Before that, it looks like they fixed the issue with Grin on 1080 Ti and 2080 Ti's. So that's about it as far as the update on better hash but it still is a solid miner in my miner cup series finals i mean this is only within 700 satoshis in a 24-hour period as compared to nice hash so it's been a solid miner for a long time i actually use this miner while well, i use the pool uh, on my amd rig so right here i will mine through the better hash pool i'll show you that in a sec so I'll show you the config file on it. Scroll down here real quick if it'll let me. So on run two, you pull this up. So you can see that the wallet is a funky wallet address and the password is a funky type password and that's the actual URL or the pool address right there in the port. So if we go to dashboard and we go over to settings, and you click on pools here's where you can actually mine through there through the pools that they use and then you can have it converted to bitcoin on their site which is what i'm doing on my amd rig i mine through their pool it goes into here and then i can convert it to bitcoin without say i'm mining ethereum classic which is what i do i don't have to go to an exchange and try and sell it there and convert it to bitcoin i can do it right through here and the cool thing is, which we will get into here right now, is that you can transfer that without a fee to Coinbase. So you go to manual withdrawal, BTC transfer, manual withdrawal, and it's calculating how much BTC I should have. That's why it's spinning right here. It actually goes through Binance and goes. it tells you right here. I think it tells you right here. Let me see. Coinbase right there. You scroll down, what is the exchange rate? We use Binance.com in order to exchange your mine currencies to Bitcoin. So all you got to do is click on the Coinbase. As you can see, the withdrawal fee is zero. So let's put my email address in there. And then click Send All Funds. About to enter my 2FA code. So I'll be back in a sec. All right, so your transfer is being processed. All funds pending. So that should be sent right over to my Coinbase account. And that's as easy as it is to transfer your funds to your Coinbase account for free. Head back over to home page. That's my CPU mining right there. And I got, well, I don't have any more. I just got rid of it. Three Ethereum Classic sitting on rare transfer pending as all of it's pending now. It's going to go over to Binance. It's going to sell all of the coins that I have, turn it into Bitcoin, and then deposit it into my Coinbase account for free. Probably have a little bit of an exchange fee, but as far as their fees, it's nothing. 
Real quick, how many of you guys out there are currently using BetterHash? Just type yes I am or no I'm not down below in the comments. Like I said in previous videos, I'm always interested in your guys' feedback. And just, just wondering how many of you guys actually use BetterHash. Do that real quick before we move on. I appreciate it. All right, so that's that, the update on BetterHash. Again, just download that there. I always put it in different versions on my on my rigs here, so I'll put it in like a miners folder. Let me pull that up if it'll let me. And always put it in its own separate folder just in case something goes wrong. So there's the previous version. There's this for at least one of the previous versions right there. And the latest version right there. So then you can just unzip it, put it there, and you go into here. And then you would just double click on a better hash right there and it'll pull up the latest version for you. It's always a good idea too to run the benchmark and then if you go over to right here settings re-download all miners just to make sure you've got all the latest versions of the miners in their software so let's get into picking a winner for this week's bitcoin fridays so here i am on the website bitcoin fridays 9619 51 contestants this week 994 entries so let's go over to manage giveaway. All right, so here we are. I'm just going to click this little button draw. Again, if you do not win, don't worry about it. I do this every week. Just make sure you are subscribed and you hit that notification bell. So when the Inch to Win video comes out, you'll be notified. All right, so good luck, everybody. And who's it going to be? All right, so we have Vincent. Congratulations, Vincent. He, Vincent's always comment on my videos. So congrats, Vincent. I'm going to go ahead now and confirm him as this week's winner. And then I'm going to notify Vincent. All right, Vincent, congratulations. Once you get that email, just respond to me with your Bitcoin address, and I will be sure to get back to you and send the funds right over. Okay, so that's it. If you guys have been wondering how profitable mining has been lately, be sure to check out my mining profitability vid that I just put out. should be popping up here in a second. Any questions or comments, be sure to put them down below. I'll always get back to you. Be sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell, and thanks for watching, guys. I appreciate it. Take care. Bye.